How to crochet the single crochet thermal stitch. For this stitch, you'll need a crochet hook and a ball of yarn. Special thanks to our sponsor, Knit Spot, for providing today's yarn. Today we are using their Bare Naked Wools line in the color Earl Grey. For this stitch, you'll need to know the following techniques. Chain stitch, single crochet. To begin this stitch, you must create a foundation chain in any even number of stitches. Row one. We're going to begin by doing a single crochet into the back loop of our second chain from our crochet hook. So we're gonna go in the top part right here. And then we will continue going into the back loop doing one single crochet into each chain stitch across our row. Row two, we're going to begin by chaining one and we will have turned our work. Then we are going to do another single crochet. So we're gonna skip the first single crochet and we're going to go into the back loop of the next single crochet. So we're going to go in this section of the stitch right here. And we're also going to go all the way through the bottom loop here. This is the open loop from our foundation chain. And we will then yarn over and draw through both loops at once. We're going to do a long draw through here. So we're about even with the loop that's on our hook then we will work our single crochet. So let me do that for you again real fast. We're going to go into the next stitch here. We're going to go through the back loop and we're going to go down into the foundation chain and pick up the loop from the row below. Then we'll yarn over and draw through both up and work our single crochet. Okay, and we're going to repeat this sequence all the way across to the end of the row. Row three, we're going to begin by chaining one. Then we are going to skip the first stitch and we will again go into the back loop of our next single crochet to do another single crochet. This time you'll notice again we have our loops along the edge here. This is the front loop from our previous row and we are going to go down into that loop and we will draw through and do a single crochet. So we're going to repeat this going through the back loop and the front loop of the previous row and working a single crochet into each stitch all the way across. So we're going to repeat row three until we've reached our desired length. And that's how you crochet the single crochet thermal stitch. Want more New Stitch Today? Check out our website at newstitchaday.com.